How long ago did you do the initial? Mm, year and a half. I'm going to kill you. I'm going to kill you. And all the cake is gone. It's all right. Have you heard Cookie's ringtone? Huh? I didn't realize we were being filmed. As far as wow. Is this Bob on TV again? Yep. Okay. Oh, are we being filmed? That's yeah, what we're being filmed. No, will the heat have an impact on the silicone? No. The tool itself never gets hot. In fact, when I was talking on the phone, I turned in front of somebody, I dropped the phone and went, oh shit, and just went totally limp. And the car rolled over, whatever. I looked around for my phone and I found it and was like, all right. And then some guy popped his head in there and I picked myself up and I was like, can you unbuckle me so I can get out of here? I get out and some guy's like, are you all right? I said, I'm fine, is the other guy all right? And the other guy said, are you okay? And I said, I'm fine. You have horns. Oh shit, I must have hit my head. Oh, oh my god, I just fucking rolled my car and a cop asked if I have horns. Fuck you. It wasn't a question, it was, you have horns. A friend of mine was driving along and a cop pulls him over and said, you know, he's doing X number of miles over the speed limit. And uh, uh, the guy's all modified. And so the cop starts asking him questions. You know, he's writing his stuff down. The cop starts asking him all this question about his body modification. And, um, and he starts talking to him about it, and then he goes, are, are you writing me a warning, or are you writing me a ticket? And he goes, oh, I'm writing you a ticket. And he goes, okay. You, you know, like, he's like, fuck you, cop, I'm not going to tell you anything else about my, you know, I'm not going to yeah. be friendly and converse with you if you're writing me a ticket. Well, I got pulled over in Arizona hauling ass out in the desert, and ended up talking to that cop for like well over an hour, and he gave me a ticket, but I'd rather just be nice to him instead of have him further bother me. This is uh, extreme, extreme branding. Hmm. I've done extreme branding before, but you know, on a scale of one to ten, this is definitely on the, the ten level of the scale. Uh, that being said, Jesse Starr is a extreme individual in his own right and can take extreme pain. And um, I'm not sadistic, I don't like to hurt people and this is going to suck for me really bad because uh, when I do work and I see the people's faces and I see the pain I'm putting them in, it really uh, literally emotionally tears me up and um, Jesse, knowing this, likes to emotionally scar me so uh, he'll be enjoying this tremendously. Um, we are not at the APP <laughs> And we are not at the Tropicana. <laughs> no, APP is officially over. This is no longer a uh, APP event. We are now just a bunch of dudes in a hotel room. Straight out of the house. One of the uh, great things, uh, anybody who's, who's taken my electrocartery laser branding course knows all this info, but um, electrocartery branding is honestly probably one of the most painful things you'll ever willingly go through. Uh, that's the downside. The upside is it's incredibly fast, and you'll you'll see this as uh, as Adam films this. If this was to be done as a tattoo, each side would probably take about two hours. And since it's being done as a brand, my guess is each side's going to take about maybe five minutes if he sits well for it. So uh, that's one thing. The second thing is is we're going significantly deeper because he wants no hair to grow back and that means I have to to actually turn the power on the machine a little higher so it's going to be a, even more intense than the first time we did it. So what kind of safety concerns are there with electrocautery branding? Um, electrocautery branding is actually an incredibly safe way to brand. Um, you, you're only uh, uh, there, there's a whole lot of information that you need to know and I recommend you take my course <laughs> on electrocardiogram. Um, I'll make a flash on the bottom. <laughs> <laughs> 
Um, but uh, I'll be teaching, no, I'm not teaching electrocardery this year at Hell City. But uh, I could be if enough people are interested. But um, there's, there's a lot of things you need to know. It's 99% safe. There's 1% if you don't know about, you could actually hurt somebody. And um, I teach that in the course. So it's literally like uh, arc welding. It works through an electrical frequency. And if we don't ground them, then uh, the, the unit doesn't function. So it has to be grounded in order for the unit to function. <laughs> <laughs> Already coming out without the class. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. You ready? Have All a good right. time. Have a sit, sit down, relax, lay your head into all that. I'm gonna wash my hands, throw on some gloves. We're gonna burn your head off. Yay! Is that a gangster frog? That is a gangster toad, man. It needs work, but it, it's pretty cool. It's pretty gangster. Yeah. <laughs> Sounds cool, too. It's a bucket of dead fish. Chum. Why do you have a chum bucket on your foot? Because, I don't know, my tattoo guy wanted to do it. Huh, okay. Move. I do not want to start on um, either of the cheeks. Okay. Um, so, really, ideally, we're just you know, it'll take a second just to adjust to it, even though you never get used to it. Just to go ahead and do the circles, because they're real quick. And then, Start with the dots? Yeah, it's just okay. do the dots. And then uh, we'll, uh, and I don't want you to, I would rather you work from like here back or from there forward, but I don't want to start right around this word, just in case things are stupid. So, okay. you know, one more time, you put your hand down, then you say... I place my hand down, I say, here we go, and one second later oh, no. I do the do. I, okay, I do the, uh, and then once we get through these dots, um, I want to do the initial first couple of times uh, for three, three count, and then what's our max count, like what, seven? Five is as, is, is as far as I can get in, okay. in one. Um, give me a two count, and then... Um, for the first couple, Step and cut. then I'll make a call there. Okay. All right. All right. So your your dots are just dots. The dot, so. Don't even worry about the dots. Just tell me. Here okay. we go, and we'll get them done. And I'm I'm gonna make these. Uh, uh, I'm gonna attempt to make these uh, follicle free. Okay. You ready? Um. Hang on. Lift your hand up real quick. I had a bottle of water that... One of the great things about electrocartery is the tool never gets hot. So it, it never actually gets warm. Um, that's so one when, of when it's con on contact? Uh, yeah, it, it vaporizes it's Like a, a, well, a, a rod welder. Okay, let me know when you're ready. I'm ready. You ready? Here we go. 